The Central Bank of Nigeria has cautioned the Nigerian government against the rising debt level in the country and we have seen a continued rejection of the 27,000 naira new minimum wage as approved by the National Council of State. All of these and more on Roots TV Nigeria's Top 5 Business News. Welcome, I am Itogi Moore, Edit. Nigerian workers have rejected the 27,000 naira minimum wage approved by the National Council of State. The union was also not comfortable with the federal government's decision to pay its workers 30,000 naira as minimum wage. Recall that the National Council of State at its Tuesday, January 22 meeting approved 27,000 naira as the new minimum wage. Meanwhile, the Asset Management Corporation of Nigeria is seeking new investors to take over Polaris Bank after elections next month and is taking stock of the bank's asset ahead of a sale. Nigerians will vote on February 16 in a presidential election where President Mohamed Buhari is seeking his second term. Polaris Bank was set up last year to take over the assets of Sky Bank PLC, which collapsed and had its operating license revoked by the Central Bank of Nigeria. The federal government says foreign exchange reserves would have crashed to as low as $2 billion if the Central Bank of Nigeria had not restricted importers from accessing Forex for the importation of about 42 items. According to the government, the release of the items on the foreign exchange restriction lease by CBN has contributed in shoring up the country's reserves to about $40 billion. Meanwhile, the Central Bank of Nigeria has cautioned the federal government against the rising debt level in the country. The CBN Monetary Policy Committee warned that except the federal government came up with measures to address the country's debt level, Nigeria's debt burden might rise up to the pre-2005 Paris Club level. In October 2005, Nigeria and the Paris Club announced a final agreement for debt relief worth $18 billion and an overall reduction of Nigeria's debt stock by $30 billion. The equities market closed Wednesday on a positive note as the NSE All Share Index appreciated by plus 0.101% the close at 30,736.88 basis point as against minus 0.88% appreciation recorded previously. Diamond Bank Access and Guarantee were the most active to boost market turnover. Guarantee and Zenith Bank top market value list. And that's all on our package. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on all of our social media platforms for updates of these and more. I am Itogi Moore, Edit. Thank you for watching.